Number 22 is almost the exact same thing as number 20, um, except for one little thing that is asking more than 20. It's asking you to find the arc length and area of a sector. So we have two things, arc length and 2 is area of sector. So we have actually two formulas that we can use for these two items. Number one, the arc length is given by R theta. And so we're going to use um, what is given, which is the radius, 16 feet. And the angle is 135 degrees. So we need to actually convert 135 into radians because we, the formula can only work with radians. So that would be times pi over 180. That will be 135 pi over 180, and we can simplify that into 3 pi over 4. And so we're going to multiply by 3 pi over 4, and cross-cancel the 4 and the 16. We have 12 pi, and since the unit is feet, so we have the arc length is actually 12 feet, 12 pi feet, I mean. And next, we're going to find the area of the sector. And the area of a sector is given by formula 1 half r squared theta. So it is not much to it other than adding the 1 half in the front and squaring the radius from the arc length. So again, the area is going to be 1 half. Radius again is 16. Square that. And the theta is the same value as the one that we found, which is 3 pi over 4. And we can actually simplify this um, all into 16 squared is actually 256 and then we have 3 pi over 4 and we can cancel out uh, 4 into 256 which is 64 and then we can also have half uh, the 2 and the 64 cancel, which is 32, and multiplying 32 times 3 is 96 pi, and the unit for an area will be square feet. So the area sector uh, with the angle of 135 degrees is 96 pi uh, square feet, and that is the final answer for the arc length and the area of the sector.